here we are on our mooring in Var, Croatia. Just warmed up the motor. Pretty crowded mooring field, so I've got to weave my way out and try not to tangle up the prop. This mooring is kind of hectic, but let's start by taking off the back lines and now I'll take the front lines off. Everything here. Just sitting over there, doing nothing. All right. Let's see what I mean, right? No flag at all. All right, so over there, I think we're okay. We made it. That was pretty tricky. That mooring buoy just kept wrapping underneath our keel. But now we're getting to the lane here. That's where we spent the first night. These docks, they just go underwater at the high tide, so not good for the fenders. Looks pretty mellow out there now, but I think it'll pick up this evening. Maybe we'll go to those islands if it's no wind. We're in uh, Dalmatian territory here. That's the Dalmatians. And now my choice is do I Sail up the coast to the Zadar, or do I just shoot all the way across over to Venice? 250 nautical miles, maybe a little less. I think I might just go straight across because uh, I have to sail back out of here next year. And I think maybe it's just save Zadar for the way for the way back. And also, it's kind of I gotta weave my way into the islands, and if the winds are light, that could be kind of a challenge. So I'll probably better to wait till I'm fresh. You know, I'm kind of heading, hitting the end of the season now, and looking at a few places to keep the boat. And in, in Venice, I uh, got some quotes that were outrageously expensive and then actually some that were quite reasonable. So looks like it should work out. We had a wind, but now I think this island's blocking it. But right when we get up there, I see some more ripples. I need to set up my little instrument thing and the autopilot too. Five point three knots, and the sail is full and happy, not flappy. Weird, this guy. Sun's about to set. We've done 18 nautical miles so far. Pretty good wind. Tomorrow, the next two days are gonna be really amazing. So actually, I think, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just shoot downwind. You see on the map. And if I head straight towards Venice, I'll hit a few of these little islands out here. And since the wind, I think it'll be good for wing foiling. I could just maybe stop for a few hours, wing foil around the islands tomorrow, like around noon maybe, when the sun's out and it's warm enough and then uh yeah maybe maybe make a stop or two and then shoot away across the rest of the adriatic and then i i'll still have lots lots of croatia to do next season and also slovenia but the forecast is really good so i'm gonna take advantage of it it's kind of starting to cool off and i think it's a good time to good time to take a break from pickled hair and litter get some r and r over the winter and then we'll be back in action, back in action uh, next season. I'm sure there'll be some, some cool adventures uh, on the off season though too.
4.30 local time or 0.530 UTC until 14.00 local time or... Day number two, we're really sailing now. So we've got about uh, 18, 18 nautical miles to the end of this island here, and then uh, we'll anchor for a little bit and pull out the wind, wing foil. About 15 knots of wind, so it should be perfect. And it's starting to warm up a little bit, so well, it shouldn't be too bad, although the further north we go, the cooler it gets. But the wind's from the south elite, so it's bringing a little of that warmer air up from Africa, I guess. Is that right? Yeah. Doing uh, five, five knots. See, overnight we did pretty well, actually. I got my little measuring, measuring guy. Oh, it's only 16 nautical miles to go. To, yeah, I wanna anchor right here. Looking on Google Maps, it's like, couldn't be more obvious where the sandy spot is. So it'll be just right over, over there. What a beautiful spot. Nice sandy bottom, very shallow. And just swing foil around here. Or maybe I'll go in that bay. That looks kind of cool too.
thanks for joining me. Uh, next video, we sail to Venice. That'll be the last video of the season, I think. And uh, that's a good one. It's about got over an hour of footage. I need to edit down for that. And uh, it ends up being my most difficult passage yet. The Mediterranean uh, saved up a, a big, some big waves to dish out to me in the, in the end. Uh, and also, arriving in Venice was a pretty cool place. Um, I got, I got locked out of the, the seawall for 24 hours, but then I got in and it was pretty rad. So I hope to see you guys then. Thanks again to all the people who have supported me through the Patreon or other donations. Uh, really great to be able to, to do these sailing trips and film my videos for y'all. So I'll see you guys then.